everyone welcome to week two of kids days this summer my name is noelle i'm so excited to have you back for week two this week in your pack you should have found a beach ball and then an instruction sheet it's called beach ball games so me and some friends are going to show you all how to play this game well these four games all right all right, so the first game I will be explaining how to do is called airborne ball. So the point of airborne ball is to balance the ball as, for as long as possible by bouncing it on a single foot. If there is a group present, everyone can stand in a circle and pass the ball to each other while keeping it airborne. This can be quite challenging and fun. Further mixes can be made by switching from the feet to the head and bouncing it there as well. So we are going to show you all how to do this. All right, does everyone get our balls? This is Lyndon, he's seven. This is Transcendence. All right, so here we go, here's our ball. So you can just bounce it on your foot. Not very good at this. Or your head. And just have fun with it. He does it better than I can. I know. <laughs> All right. Awesome. The next game we are going to teach y'all is indoor bowling. So you are going to set up a tower of paper cups, yogurt containers, or a variety of plastic containers headed for the recycling in a triangle formation and roll the ball towards them and try to knock them down. And a tip is the cups or containers don't have to match or be in an exact formation. So you can use anything that will knock over easily. I will show y'all our tower. This is what we're going to be knocking over. Um, yeah, we want to hold it. Okay, so Lyndon, do you want to try to bowl, knock it over? like that. You got it. Or you can go like this. Nice try. All right. So I'm going to try. Got one. Oh, don't put it back. <laughs> all right. Try again. So the goal is to knock them all down. So that's as good as it will get with that. Let's see. For the next game, for the next game we are going to be explaining is kick the can. In this childhood classic, the goal is to kick an object, in this case the ball, placed in the middle of the yard. The ball is protected by a guard who tries to tag anyone approaching the ball before it's reached. If the guard succeeds in tagging before anyone can kick the ball, he is the winner. If someone is able to outmaneuver the guard and kick the ball, however, she wins the game and becomes the new guard for the next round. So this game requires a little bit more people than we have. Um, I recommend playing it with four or more people. So we are going to show you all the best that we can with us three, all right? All right, so we're going, see, I'll be the guard, and I have the, do I hold it or is it? No, the, it's, it's on okay. the ground, and then you just maneuver around it. Okay, so y'all come and try to take the ball away from me. Oh, <laughs> dang it. <laughs> so now Lyndon would be the guard now. So you have the ball, Lyndon. Okay, you try to guard it, I'll try to get it from you. <laughs> you, you have to tag people if they get too close. Yeah, if you tag us. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> okay, <laughs> no, no pushing. <laughs> All right, so that was kick the can. The next game is ball tag. The point of this game is to tag one another with the balls instead of using your hands. Be sure to use a ball that won't hurt when it's thrown at running players. So that's why we have the beach balls. Let's see. Make a rule that nobody is to aim above the shoulders to avoid potential injuries. So if you hit someone in their head, then you're out. For even more of a twist, allow multiple kids to be it and give one a ball to tag out the others. All right. So this is pretty much just tag with a ball. Make sure you're not throwing the ball hard because um, we don't want to hurt our friends, right? All right. So let's get our balls. Wait, is one person, is it? I'm, I'm not, well, there, there was a version of the game where most, they were all dead. Oh. But which one are we talking about? Okay. So let's do a first version where okay. one person is it. Okay. So, Lyndon, if you want to be it and try to tag us with the ball, you can't throw it hard, okay? But I throw it? Yeah, throw okay. it. And since there's multiple balls, maybe you can use any of them. Okay. Yeah. I want to okay. use this one. Alright, all right. hurry up, come to us. No, 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 you have to throw it. You have to throw it. Alright, try to get us. You have to throw it. Okay, so I'm out and she wins that round. So the other version of the game is that everyone gets a ball and you're all it. So you're all trying to tag each other. So I could. Tag. Okay. I'm trying to tag <laughs> oh. So I'm out again. All right. So that is how you play this week's activity with um, your beach ball. Be sure to call us or email us at the cell. No, I mean at the <laughs> phone number and the email address listed below. And, and tell us about your experiences and you could be entered to win a prize at the end of this six week um, summer kids days. So thank you for joining us for week two. See you next week. I'll say bye. Bye.